Hi everybody, Alexis here with Ode Modesty. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel today. Today I have the unboxing of the Trunk Club by Nordstrom. And if you're interested in fashion and style and see what they have to offer, stay tuned. about this trunk okay and it's by Nordstrom's it's called the Nordstrom trunk club and just like any other styling service you have to fill out a in-depth survey and then they style you based on what you answer in that questionnaire and uh, Nordstrom's is no different and matter of fact I think they were one of the first ones to actually come up with something like this I may be wrong about that but I know they're one of the originals and now there's a lot of box um, subscriptions out there today but Anyhow, what they do is they send a box actually shaped and pictured like a real trunk. And it comes in different sizes. It depends on uh, what you get because they do send shoes and they do send other things that are large. And so you'll get a larger box. And to be honest with you, um, I have not been having really good luck lately with Nordstrom's. In the past, you had a dedicated stylist. And now they've gone to the team model. And when somebody finally gets what you're going for they switch up on you and so that's been a little bit of a challenge and i know that's the little murmur that's going on out there in the um in the community Trunk as well club there is a styling fee of 25 dollars unless of course you have a nordstrom's card then that fee is waived and if you decide to try it after seeing what i get i will leave a code below so please click on that and you will get 50 dollars off your first order and that's how I really got into it and it's great and as far as the um, cost for Nordstrom's um, their site says their pieces range anywhere from $50 to $300 per piece but you know I, that hasn't been really true for me I've gotten really good deals because they will send you things that are on sale as well and so without further ado let's get into I it I gone ahead and cut the little tabs off because I remember it being uh, really difficult last time so um, like I said it, it comes with a tape and you just kind of open it up and I uh, hope I don't drop everything this is how it comes okay and let me turn this around a little it says and now for the fun kind of unpacking here it is love your look we want to see okay here you go and this is how it's open and here it comes like this and so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these pieces out and then um, I will show you what the pieces are and after that we can go ahead and try it on but I'm gonna take do this off camera because it, this is you get the point right so I'll be right back hey. Whew. mission accomplished uh, there's actually eight pieces in here which is a lot and so I'm sure I'm gonna be able to make a lot of outfits with it. And first of all, when I was digging around, I said, oh yeah, I forgot about that paperwork. Very important to uh, mention it. You get a little packet like this and it says, we can't wait for you to see what's inside Trunk Club. I mean, they really do it right, you know, Nordstrom's. And um, I really like their clothes. I just wish that they would go back to the model of, um, you know, single dedicated uh, stylist. So that way, once they get to know me, they know me and they could send me really good things. But by the looks of the box uh, really quick, it looks pretty good. Anyway, I digress. Um, so what you're gonna get in here is of course, they personalize it. Hello, Alexis. Try on these clothes. Tell us what you think. Keep what you love and make your selections and then send back what you don't love. And another thing that'll be in here is because it is a trunk, it's really easy. You just put it back in there. They have these two little like a sticker and you close it up. Uh, with these stickers and you slap this on the outside of it and then you just take it to the USPS to the post office and or UPS I'm sorry not post office it is UPS and either you can call them to pick it up at your home or you can drop it off my UPS is actually right across the street and it's much easier for me to just go ahead and take it over there and just drop it off so that's what I usually do so anyway let's get started first piece here okay already we're doing good this is a uh, wit and wisdom uh, it looks like dark jeans and indigo I would say and this is the absolution itty bitty boot so that means it's a boot cut and it is the only problem is I have 
I have tons of this color, indigo, and I've been asking them to please send me something of a stone wash, but that's okay. I'll just go ahead and try it on anyway. And this is my one of my favorite uh, wit and wisdom. Um, so I'm sure I'm gonna love it. And I don't think I have a uh, boot cut. So I'll go ahead and put this aside and try it on. Okay, and the next piece, um, let's see. And this is by Zella. Oh, I love Zella. I, I have a couple of their, um, uh, what is it there? Uh, jogging shorts, uh, shorts. Did I say shorts? Not shorts. I don't wear shorts. <laughs> Joggers, and uh, that I wear around the house, lounging around. It's so comfortable, and I love Zella products. And I, I got a couple of them on sale for the anniversary sale too. And so this is the um, actual sweatshirt. Okay, let me do this way. I'll never be Vanna, but that's okay. Um, this is really nice. It's a sweatshirt. It's nothing special, but I like the wash and I love gray as you notice So that's one of my primary uh, Colors that I keep neutrals all the time. Okay, and let's see the next one is oh Goodness Nick and Zoe. I love their stuff and look this is so very cute So very cute. This would be nice to layer over a Of course being this is short. I would have to layer this over a nice blouse and a skirt because for jeans um, I it won't cover up and so but this is still very nice oh I'm dying to try this on now okay and this one here is Topshop that's another thing that Topshop has some really nice things again it's cropped kind of high hmm you know these crops I don't usually wear crops because of um, like I just said I would have to wear these with skirts I can't wear these with pants Unless, of course, I wear a shirt, I layer it over a shirt that's uh, really long, um, so that way I can cover my behind. I have to do that. So, you know, we're trying to be modest here. So, you know, whatever I do with it, you know what? Let me see what I can think of when I show you, when I put it on. Maybe I can make it modest with pants. One can always try. You know, this is the whole purpose of this channel, right? <laughs> okay, let's see. Something else great. Boy, when I said I like gray, they really listen. But, you know, they could have sent anything else aside from gray, but no, it's okay. So, okay, this looks really tiny, but these are like the stretchy, uh, looks like a layering shirt. And uh, this is actually by uh, Intimately, hmm, Intimately. I wonder if this is like just a layering shirt from underneath. It looks like it. I don't think I'd be able to wear this on the outside without anything else. So, okay, we'll just give that a try for as, as a layering piece. Oh, another one in the same color. Really? What? What's what? What's going on? I said no dark, and they sent me two dark ones. You see, this is what I mean by dedicated stylist. I wrote specifically, please no dark or indigo or black jeans. I have plenty of them. Believe me, I have about eight pairs in this shade. Again, it's Wit and Wisdom, which is my my favorite brand, and this one is called Modern Absolution Lux Touch. And this one, you could tell, is um, the other one is a boot cut. I doubt I'll keep this one because I have a lot of these um, straight leg skinny jeans um, already. And again, this, I mean, this tone, yeah, not good. And this is in six piece. Okay, they got the size right at least. Okay. And next, again, gray. Hmm. Oh, this is pretty. Whoa, look at the size of that sleeve. This is like... You know, my, that's another thing too, right? Uh, my arms are really short. I'm petite, I'm only 5'2", so I usually ask them to send me petite sizes and it doesn't look like they did that. And on top of this, this is large. I wear a small, hello? And I get it, I'll be layering like a tons of stuff underneath this because look, can you see me? Because I can see you, no go. So um, yeah, I I'll see, maybe I'll have to, well, I guess this will be okay over a turtleneck, but I don't love it, so I doubt I'm going to keep it because I'm getting so much sweaters now in my inventory, and it's I'm not going to keep anything that I don't love. So, But we'll see. I'll try it on for you, though, okay? And you let me know if I should keep it. Okay, and here we go. This is the last piece, and this is yet another large. What is up with this large? Oh my, okay, at least it's not gray, yeah? So, but still, black and gray, black and gray, this is all I have. 
And so let's see. And this is by, oh, Free People. Oh, I love that brand. You know what? Let me try it on because usually they, their stuff looks kind of funky um, on the hanger. But when you try it on, it's really nice. But what is this? See, that's another thing too, right? I mean, yeah. You see those little spots? See? Oh, yeah. They need to run a, oh my, it's leaving a, like fuzzies on me too. They need to put a roller on it. So, yeah, okay. Well, we'll see. So, that's eight pieces and two pairs of jeans with a bunch of shirts and sweaters. So, definitely, I cannot, there's nothing in here that I can make a complete outfit without having to pull on my stock or my own clothes other than um, that. Well, I guess I could pair with that gray uh, long sleeve, but, hmm, hmm. Hmm, no, I, I think I'm gonna have to throw something on that's mine. So, well, I'll be right back. Okay, here we go, let's just dive in. And so the outfit that I'm wearing, two pieces are actually from the trunk club. And of course my shoes, my boots, and my uh, duster is actually mine. And I have to wear that just so I can make it kind of uh, modest, okay? But um, as you can see, this is the um, Itty Bitty uh, Boot uh, Jeans. And this is from Wit and Wisdom. And this is the free people, they call it sweater, but it actually seems like a, uh, just a, like a sweatshirt. And so let me give you the specifics of that. Um, the jeans is a Wit and Wisdom Absolution Itty Bitty Boot in Indigo in 6P, and it lists for $68. And the free people Ricky Mock Neck Sweater, and it's a medium, and it's list for $30. And so let's see. Um, if I can just go ahead and show you the, how, how it lays in the back. Okay. Okay, the next look. Again, um, the, I kept the shirt actually, and then I changed the jeans. As you notice, these are not the boot cut, but these are actually the Widow Wisdom Modern Absolution High Rise, also an Indigo and 6P. And these retail for $78, but this is very nice. Uh, but this is the basic, um, uh, not a capri, but um, ankle cut. And um, unfortunately I have a lot of these, uh, and especially in this color and black and white and everything else. Um, I like the cut, uh, but I think um, they sent me exactly what I said I had too many of. Um, although the boot cut one, the initial one, I think I really like that one because I don't have any boot cut ones. Anyway, these are very comfortable. It's very stretchy, and I like the fact that they are absolutions. Okay, here you go, and this is how you'll be able to wear it. Okay, outfit number three. Um, the only new addition is the Billabong sweater, and this is by uh, Billabong, and it's Free the Breeze sweater, and I can see why they call it that, because it is quite um, breezy. Um, but I did keep the actual um, the sweater sweatshirt initial try on. And so this actually comes in handy because you can wear this with, the, as you can see, with a lot of things and the color is very neutral. And this actual um, sweater is in ink, is the color, and it's in large and it is quite large and it um, sells for $59.95. Let me show you the back. You see how? And it's, it's quite warm, which um, surprises me because it is breezy, but I don't, I don't know, it, is, it may be just warm in my house right now. But anyway, um, I just paired it with a nice flowing skirt. And you could actually wear these with jeans. I wouldn't be able to because it doesn't go low enough to cover um, my backside. But I mean, definitely this would be very cute with a pair of jeans. Okay, this is outfit number four. Again, my own skirt and my shoes. Uh, I did keep again um, the sweatshirt underneath, although I wouldn't need it with this one because this is boucle and the top is very thick. And I, I really like, I've been enjoying boucle. I just got a, a nice um, jacket actually from a Nord Nordstrom's um, anniversary sale. So, you know, I'm really digging this because um, it's really warm and I, I have a feeling we're gonna have a bad winter. And so um, it's always good. And so anyway, this is um, by Free People, and it's called Found My Friend Boucle Pullover. It's in medium, 
and of course it's in black and it's it retails for $78 but I really like this oversized sleeve it's like a bell sleeve and it's really very comfortable and it's very nice with this with this outfit you know I mean maybe a necklace a nice long necklace or something like that I'm really curious to hear what you have to say so please comment on what you think here you go okay outfit number five what do you think it's the same shirt um, I, you know I'm really this is really growing on me you know at first when I saw it I'm like mm, yeah no not me but when I'm it's really comfortable and you it's so versatile as you notice I this is the fifth um, outfit change and I haven't changed the shirt and it's really nice and it goes with any color and I love gray by the way and so the new addition here is the Nick and uh, Zoe uh, jacket here the blazer Okay, and let me tell you a little about that. It's Nick and Zoe fringe mixed jacket in black, and it's a medium petite, and it retails for $79.20. And this is actually really nice. And uh, one of the things that um, I have troubles with is blazers or jackets that are not petite, because my arm is extra short. I'm shorter than normal for somebody who is actually five feet two. And so I have a problem with it. Even with the um, petite ones, sometimes uh, they may be longer, so. Here it is. Okay, what do you think? I really could dress this down or up. I decided to dress it down with a pair of sneakers. Oh, hi, Rosie, we have a visitor. Hi. hi. Okay, in a minute, okay. So anyway, this is Rosie. Yes, she's very vocal. Okay. So, uh, as I was saying, sorry about that. As I was saying, this is, um, the jacket is the one that's I added and it is by Topshop and it's called a boxy crop shirt jacket and cream and it's a medium petite and 54 40. And you remember I was saying something about sometimes even the petite, the sleeves are long. This is a good example of that. See, so sometimes it does, uh, run a little large even for me, but as I said, you could just go ahead and add a pair of, you know, if, if you wear this during the day, you're maybe touring somewhere or uh, you're actually on vacation and you don't want your feet to hurt so you kind of dress it down and at night you can easily turn this actually um, into a night outfit by adding heels and just opening this up and relaxing it and possibly rolling up the sleeves if you wanted to and so and i love these pockets here let's see handy pockets Okay, this is the last piece, and which is a sweatshirt here. And actually, I paired it with my Zella um, joggers. I was gonna say sweatpants, but they actually call them joggers. And I really love these. I got these at Nordstrom's also for, at the anniversary sale. They were great price, and they're very nice. And I thought, you know, this is a Zella top, so let me just pair, uh, pair it with my Zella bottoms and also my little, uh, I love Hawaii flip flops. Um, this is actually how I lounge at home most of the time because I am working from home right now. And so this is actually my go-to outfit for now. And so let me tell you a little about the, um, the piece, okay? It is Zella Jamie Krunick sweatshirt in gray dapper. And this is a medium and it retails for $59. And it is long enough um, to um, cover my backside, but of course if I go outside I always uh, put a, a jacket or something on to just make sure um, as I move, you know, my lift. So, uh, but just to show you, uh, this is actually uh, very comfortable. So, what do you think? What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and quickly go over again, although um, you should be seeing it in the screen as we went by. Um, but uh, let me give you the rundown, the summary uh, before um, I end this. So, uh, let's see, the first piece was Wit and Wisdom Absolution Itty Bitty Boot, uh, which was an Indigo, and 6P, and it retailed for $68. That one I'm considering keeping because, like I said, even though I have the color, I don't have the cut. And that's also very nice to go out in, and you can dress it up or dress it down depending on the type of boot and the shirt, the top that you'll wear. And so I'm thinking about that very seriously. And the next piece was the Free People Ricky Mock Neck Sweater, which I kept on throughout the whole, uh, th throughout this whole showing, right? And so I, I just, it's growing, growing on me. And it is a medium and it is $30, which is very fair priced for the fabric and um, the quality of it. 
And so I'm considering that one. And then the next piece was the Wit and Wisdom Modern Absolution High Rise Indigo Jeans, which was the ankle cut one. That one was in 6P and it retails so for $78. But that one, I'm not, I'm going to go ahead and send back because, um, like I said, I have many in that color and that cut, I have plenty of that um, color and, and size and everything. So I'm just going to let that one go back. And then the next piece was the Billabong Free the Breeze Sweater in Ink. And that was in large, and I think that was a little bit too big because it kept falling. I don't know if those are meant to be off the shoulder. They didn't describe it to be that way, but it ended up being that way for me. And, and I just don't like fighting with my clothes the whole time. Um, you know, I, I'm out. So I think I'm gonna let that go back, but that one retails for $59.95. And, um, and the next one that I really liked, that fit really well, and this was a medium, and maybe that's why, it was by Free People Found My Friend Boucle Pullover in black. And that one actually retails for $78, and it's very well made. And so it's really, in the Free People, I really like that brand. And um, it's a comfortable brand, it's a friendly brand for me. And I'm, I'm really brand loyal. And so I am thinking about keeping that one. I just need to look at my closet to see, do I have anything like it? And if I do, it's gonna have to go back, but I don't have any boucle sweaters. I know that, although I have a jacket, um, a floor length jacket, but I don't think I have the sweater and boucle. So um, I'll think about that one. And then the next piece I really liked as well, which is a Nick and Zoe French mixed jacket in black. And that was also a medium petite and perfect um, sleeves length, which is rare for me to find. And uh, that one retails for $79.20. And then the next one, which was a Top Shop um, boxy crop shirt jacket, which was in cream. That was a medium petite, but as you saw, the sleeve is a little bit longer, um, even though you can roll it up. Um, hmm, I'm not feeling it. I, I, I didn't really enjoy it. It looks nice. I mean, it's a beautiful piece, but it's not me. And that one retails for $54.40, which is also not bad for a Top Shop. And then the last piece, uh, which I'm still wearing, is the Zilla Jamie Krunick sweatshirt. And this is in gray dapple, and I love gray, aside from black. And it's in medium, and this retails for $59, and it's super comfortable. It looks like, I mean, if you look at it, I mean, it looks like it's been worn, and it's been with me for a long time, even though it's brand new, but it, it just has that look and the feel about it. And I really like that because when I'm hanging out at home, I want to be comfortable, right? And so, and this, this actually meets all of my expectations. So I'm very curious to what you think, and please leave a comment. And if you enjoyed this video, please like, and please subscribe. And I will be unboxing, I believe, um, Transcend coming soon. So please join me again. And thank you so much for spending your precious time with me today. And remember, never sweat the small stuff. Hello, hello, hello. This is Rosie. Say hello, Rosie. She has a sister. Her name is Lily. And she is asleep though, I think. Yeah. Your sister is a lazy one. You're the curious one. Yes, you are. Say bye to the people. Bye, people. See you soon.